Hi friends, welcome to Azure video tutorials. This session I am going to explain you about how to create link services for Azure Blob Storage. The previous session I have already covered on how to create a link services for Azure Data Lake Store. So this session I am going to create new link service for Blob Storage account. So if you go to your ADA version 2 author then there is there is a connections if you click on connections you can find link services there you can create a new link services click on new and it will display list of uh, supporting uh, technologies or supporting objects which you can create a link services uh, if you go to azure that azure products it will display there you can select Azure Blob Storage. Azure Blob Storage. Click on this. Click on continue. So name, user defined name, you can select any user defined name. So I'm giving here link services blob. And uh, integration runtime, a uh, default uh, integration runtime I have selected this. And account key this is the default account key and there are two ways we can connect one using is azure subscription other one is enter manually so i am using a default uh, subscription the selective our account then loading its key so test connection to link service or you can test with the file path so default you can go for link services here test connection so it's taking some time see connection is successful now you can click on create this so i am going to create link services for my azure blob storage okay and if you click on this code it will show the json format okay you can connect this block using this link services this is the connection string okay and this account name receiver blob name this is another way click on this new uh, select your azure blob storage using manually instead of subscription you can give your storage account name so go to your uh, this is all the resources this is my blob storage this is my blob storage account name this one and the storage key if you go to properties Here you can find the complete storage keys, subscriptions, everything. Okay. This is your subscription ID. Or if you go to overview, if you go to containers, these are all containers available containers. If you go to properties, this is your account name and uh, this is your complete access path for your folder if you go to access policy if you want to create any access policies here you can create access policies okay and the overview this is my uh, folder okay Done. So we need access keys, right? So this is your access key. This is your connection string. So connection string means with your account name and account key will be there. So we need access key. Let's copy this. Okay. If you go to your blob storage and access keys, you will get that keys and other information. If you go to properties. 
you will get the storage or resource ID and other information here you can see okay this primary blog or service endpoint this URL same thing for secondary blog was URL so we need we need here storage account name and storage account key that if you go to access keys this is your key if you want to know the name directly here you can see the name or here you can see the name account name okay this is a string connection string but we need only key here so I'm going to copy this so why they are giving connection string means in previous versions AD of previous versions we need to give a complete connection string so that's the reason you can copy this connection string including your name and uh, service endpoint protocols that's a hypertext so, uh, HTTPS account name including key but here we need only key and name so I have given the name and key now you can click on test connection see connection is successful you can go for pathwise there's a container my container is staging I'm testing connection is successful you can create this to link services or to particular path so I have created this you can get the JSON this is your link service account name and encrypted credentials that is your key okay so this is the way we can go for creating new link services for your blob storage okay thank you for watching my videos please subscribe my channel to get more videos and updates on my channel thank you very much